The Bucks coming into the arena, confident they'll be walking out of here with a precious win on the road. A gorgeous evening in Beantown, the historic city of Boston is the backdrop tonight. Game one of the Eastern Conference Semis. Everything gets turned up a notch. Let's get to it here on 2K Sports. We'll watch the Boston Celtics in this one as they go up against the Milwaukee Bucks. Brian Anderson here with you. Our analysts tonight, Chris Weber and Grant Hill. Also, Allie LaForce on the sidelines. Hey, Allie. Jason Tatum, already an all-star, but he won't rest until he's a superstar. He said, quote, nobody puts higher expectations on me than myself. When I have big games, I try not to get too excited because the guys I look up to, they do it often. I want to get to the point where when I do it, it's kind of like another night. Brian? All right, Allie, thanks. Now let's take a look at the Bucks opening lineup. Giannis plays the four with Lopez in the middle. Wesley Matthews out there with Drew Holiday. And it's Portis in at the three, the small forward. And for the Celtics, Smart and Brown, a great defensive backcourt. Al Horford out there with Robert Williams. And it's Tatum in at the small forward. You take a look at the Bucks. And you just wonder how exhausted they are at this stage, given how many games they played in the first round. Yeah, I mean, it's certainly a test of their endurance and their focus. I really look for their bench to play a big part in tonight's game if they're to win. Tip-off goes to Milwaukee. Holiday against Smart. Holiday passes to Anacumpo. Outside Holiday. Good! And Anadokounmpo gets the assist. Smart play by Giannis. Moving the ball with a purpose leads to a great look. Pass to Williams. Count it. That's pretty much any coach. That's how he'd like to start the game. Holiday with the ball. Here's Matthews, defended by Brown. Back to Anadokounmpo, inside. Here's Lopez. The rebound, Celtics. Man, with the balls in his hands, that's as high percentage as it is. It's just a fluke miss. And it's smart missing. Here are the first, a little over a minute played so far. Pass to Lopez. From outside, off the mark. The Celtics on offense. Left side, Tatum. Over Holiday. Tatum can't hit. I thought that one was going to go down. Mid-range jumpers. Oh, man, that's usually a bunny with the deep playing soft like that. Now here's Holiday. Matthews. And the Bucks miss again. Outside, Brown. It's smart on the wing. Nails it from three. And, and that's how you build confidence in your shot. Smart, able to set his feet off the catch and shoot. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. They're struggling here. Bro. One for five now. The D has been bottled up so far. Here's Brown. Smart passes to Williams. No good. Good work defensively by Lopez. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Oh, a dunk and a foul! A powerhouse move! He's got a chance for one more at the line. That one on Tatum. Giannis shooting one. Giannis' commitment to delivering a superstar performance for his team. The effort he puts out on the floor really can't be overstated. Now here's Tatum over Holiday. 
pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. His offensive skill set is off the charts. He has more than a few ways to punch. Outside Holiday. Pass to Portis. On to Kumpo inside. Pounded by Tatum. They get it back. Here's Lopez. And the layup falls. I love to see more of this for Lopez. He has the size to be a force on the glass. And in the first quarter, about three minutes played. Smart passes to Williams. Pass to Tatum. And Drew Holiday gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. And just wasn't able to set up in time. Smart passes to Horford. Kicks it out to Smart. There's the three. And again, Boston with the triple. I just love his approach coming into tonight. Focused and aggressive. Pass to Matthews. Smart against Holiday. Now Porter. 4-3. Drops in the three. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Well, these days, so much emphasis on the perimeter game. But you can see why after that sequence. Now here's Tatum. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. And real quick, let's check out the field goal percentage leaders in the postseason. Jason Tatum, fourth. And, of course, Giannis Antetokounmpo. They've been both taking great shots. That's the efficiency you want in the postseason. Here's Matthews. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Holiday against Tatum. Ana Kumpo inside. Can't there to take the lead, but a miss. Boston's gone two for two from deep to start this one. And Tatum, here we go. Can't get it to drop. The Bucks have gone 4 of 10, shooting the rock in this first quarter. Going inside. <laughs> when Giannis starts to drive, the defense knows it's in trouble. He powers right through them. And here's Smart. He's got six. Portis with the steal. Holiday against Smart. Now Holiday. Pass to Matthews. Here's Portis. Honor to Kumpo with it. Hounded by Tatum. Just four to shoot. Ooh, he faded back he on that one to give himself some room. Honor to Kumpo has got seven points in the game. Boston trailing. Smart passes to Horford. Tatum from long range. Boston again missing. Not the most productive quarter he'll ever have, but his shot selection has been a little bit. Pass to Holiday. Knocked loose. Lopez finds Portis. Here's Matthews. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Now here's Smart. There's Tatum with the three. And the three-pointer goes. Oh, nice look there from Smart. Finding the open man. The Bucks have gone six of 13 so far in this one. Holiday passes to Lopez. Tried to answer back, but that three is off the mark. The Celtics have gotten 50% of their shots to fall so far. They're five of 10. Pass to Horford. Left side, Tatum. On the take. Yep, that one's good. He has seven. Beautiful job by Tatum right there. I mean, the ball handling skills incredibly advanced for such a young front court player. Time out call. Milwaukee. No Fans, your Celtics dancers. Give them a hand, fans. It's your Celtics dancers dance 
Dean. Pass to Matthews. Here's Lopez. It falls. He's now 2 of 5 from the field. What a gift to score Lopez is. Even in the face of the defense, he scores when he stays focused. Smart passes to Horford. Left side, Williams. Now here's Tatum. He's covered by Holiday. Oh, he powers right through the defender for the dunk. Draws the foul, too. And he'll go to the line. That's on Brooke Lopez. Lopez. That's you look at the Bucks. Well, they've got to be happy with their postseason performance thus far. But the road only gets tougher from here. <laughs> it sure does. I mean, they're going to be working as the underdogs. But one way to flip that, win tonight and seize home court advantage. But if you think back to Tatum's rookie year, he was the go-to guy in the 2018 Eastern Conference Finals. I mean, what a valuable experience he gave that season. Now here's Portis. And it's out of the Kumpo, off the drive. Got it. Makes him four for six from the floor. Oh, he's got a roll in this quarter. Take Boston. it on himself to Time guide their offense. And Boston calls time here. And some changes here for the Celtics. Tice checked in for Williams. And Williams is subbed in for Horford. Connaughton, he's checked in for the Bucks. Allen comes in for Matthews. Now here's Smart. Six points for him. Tice outside. Outside, Brown. Clock at six. Goes back up, and he takes it up and lays it in. And the Celtics lead by two. Oh, the never-quit attitude of Brown. Outstanding at remaining engaged and keeping plays going. Here's Smart. Shot is good. Off the back rim and in. Smart's got eight points. For Milwaukee, they've gotten eight of 16 attempts to fall. Pass to Portis. On the wing, Holiday. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Holiday. Part of passing the rock is calculating risk and reward. I don't think that was a great decision. The Celtics making a switch here. Pritchard's checked in. Boston's gone three of four on threes here in this first quarter. Brown with it. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Uh, yeah, even a slight movement is going to catch a ref's eye. I mean, they're trained to focus on that. Holiday with the ball. Pass to Allen. To the inside. And Antetokounmpo with the stop. And sometimes it seems like Giannis can dunk without any effort at all. He just glides to the rim like it was nothing. Here's Pritchard. And here's Tatum. Giannis Antetokounmpo grabs the board. It's one thing to prevent the layup. It's another to do it without fouling. Just terrific defense. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. Second team foul. So it's Boston now. Here's Pritchard. Pass to Brown. Back to Pritchard. Six to shoot. Shoots over Allen. Pritchard gets it to go. And the Celtics lead by four. And <laughs> they keep trading punches. Both teams in a groove early. Yeah, and this is what you love to see. Both teams going at it, working to get to their spots and cashing in. Celtics foul. Peyton Pritchard. That's 
That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Pass to Allen. Williams against Anadokounmpo. Holiday up top to the left side wing. Portis finds Allen. Three-pointer, no good. The Celtics shooting at around 59%. Their offense is clicking right now. Here's Pritchard. Allen defending. Milwaukee foul. Grayson and the Bucks making a change here. Ibaka's checked in. Third team foul. In for the Bucks. Serge Ibaka. Tatum against Holiday. And Drew Holiday gets the whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. Bucks on D. Trailing by four. All alone from mid-range. You've got to think he's kicking himself. Here's Connaughton. No scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Anadokounmpo, right side. Over Tice. Tice again. And it's finished off by Anadokounmpo as he lays it in. Adenakumpo has got 13. Boston's gone three of four on threes here in this first quarter. The two fouls and we're not even out of the Boston. first quarter. That, that's not a good Two pace to set. Foul. Fifteen foul. All right, well, a look at how the hustle game has been going for the Celtics. They're showing a lot of energy in the open court here in the first half. Pushing it every chance they get and racking up those points on the break. One thing I've also noticed is how quick their hands have been tonight. Thanks to that, they've gotten a lot of points off turnovers. The first one falls. White, he's checked in for Boston. off on the second the Bucks trail a minute 29 left in the first Holiday passes to Ibaka now Allen blocked here's Pritchard pass to White Williams up top. It's hauled in by Connaughton. Milwaukee has gone just one of six from the three-point line so far. There's 53 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Boston with the ball. It's a three-point game. Here's Pritchard into the lane. That one is off. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Pass to Tice. Sixteen seconds left in the opening quarter. Richard, no good. Now Holiday. Shoots over White. And the basket by Holiday. Holiday. Holiday's got his second basket of the night. And so it's Jason Tatum making highlights for the Boston Celtics. 
He put together 10 points in the quarter. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. One thing that makes the Greek Freak so dominant is he drives to score, but also to pass. He breaks it down for us. I'm a lot more comfortable. Uh, it's because my teammates trust me, my team trusts me to make the right play. And, you know, lately, late uh, in the game, I'm just trying to make the right play. That can be a pass, uh, that can be a shot, but that's my mindset down the stretch. Grant, I love that Giannis is not worried about the numbers. I mean, B.A., he just wants to win. That's another thing that makes him great. Happy to have you back with us for the Eastern Conference semifinals on 2K Sports. All right, guys, what do you think about the Celtics here in this one? Oh, what I love was that first quarter was all about leaking out and capitalizing in transition. The game being fast-paced these days, you expect this from a lot of teams. They did it very good. Martin Brown, a great defensive backcourt. Derek White out there with Al Horford. And it's Tice in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the five to begin the second quarter for the Celtics. Now here's Smart. Pass to Horford. From downtown. And it's Smart missing. And Milwaukee shooting the rock well at 46%. Tice against Carter. Portis with it. Over smart. Porter's shot is off. Boston's gone three of six from deep so far. Now here's White. The three ball. Here's Tice. Gets a second attempt to go. Now he's one for two. Activity on the glass. That's a possession that could have gotten away from him. Carter against Smart. Pass to Portis. And he sinks that one, Assisted hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Portis has got five. Got to fight harder to get over those screens. We see this all too often. You have to be willing. Outside, Brown. And there's the drive. And the jam by Brown. you got to love how Brown finishes strong, driving fast and hard to the cup for the rim rock in Shazam. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. Pass to Portis. Back to Collinson. Three-pointer. Tice grabs the miss. Tice has got rebound number five here tonight. Outside, Brown. Smart passes to Horford. And they call an illegal screen here. You can get away with one once in a while. But it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. Yeah, you can't blame the ref for making that call at all. The defense in general is already at such a disadvantage as it is. And a chance there to look back at the stunning mobile one block a moment ago. You know that block has him and his teammates all pumped up. That is what playoff basketball is all about. Here's Matthews. Looking for his first basket still in this one. And we're just over two and a half minutes into the second. Here's Brown. And he drops it in from the low post. And now a five-point Boston lead. Oh, you love the level of concentration Brown maintains. I mean, taking the hit well and finishing in style. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Down low. Tice against Lopez. Tice grabs the miss. Tice has got six rebounds now in the game. Seems like this offense is being executed the way it was designed. Yeah, I'm sure Coach couldn't be happier with the results. You can really feel the momentum swinging in their direction. They've been a more cohesive team over this stretch, and that helps account for their lead. Timeout called. Milwaukee. Yeah, they're hoping to turn things around with this timeout. Uh, yeah, they have to revisit their strategy at the defensive line. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. 
Portis, right side. Back to Carter. Pass to Matthews. Now here's Lopez. Rebounded by the Celtics. Tice has got a seventh rebound here tonight. And until he starts knocking down some shots, I don't think the deficit's going to get this one. On the drive, smart. That one's off, and now he's three for six. Milwaukee has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Now here's Carter. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Outside, Brown. Smart passes to Tice. Back to Smart. Horford for three. They get the rebound. And the basket by Tice. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. The Bucks trail. Pass to Connaughton. Tries to snap the cold streak. Sinks the tray. Connaughton's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Smart against Carter. Smart up top. Give him eight. There's Tice with a three. Rebounded by the Bucks. Oh, man. As good of a shooter as he is, it drives him crazy to miss a wide open three. Uh -huh. And it's out of bounds to the Bucks as Milwaukee retains possession. Allen, he's checked in for the Bucks. Racing Allen. Carter with it. Pass to Lopez. Portis outside. Now Allen shoots over Brown. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. The three. And count it. Now five for seven. Oh, you love to see Brown knock down the three ball, showing great strides and improving his range. Here's Allen. Carter, pass to Allen. To the paint. And it's Lopez, Lopez, that time on the assist from the Allen. Assist. Lopez Grayson has got six. Allen. He's using all that size in the paint. Lopez, he's always excelled when he capitalizes in this area. And here's Brown for three. The rebound by Carter. Milwaukee has gone just one of four from downtown so far in the second. Pass to Lopez. With the defensive effort. The Celtics with the lead. Smart right side. Shoots over Allen. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his second. That's on Brooke Lopez. And I think working himself to the line, an area where Smart really can excel. I mean, he's built for contact. That's for sure. two shots. For Smart, a six foot four, 220 pounds. Marcus Smart might be the most physically imposing point guard in the league, especially with this fiery approach to the game. Williams has checked in for Boston. Williams comes in for Horford. Drew Holiday's checked in for the Bucks. And so Smart nails them both. And the Bucks shooting 40% from the field in this one. Allen against Brown. Allen, the pass to Portis. Soft touch off the glass. Portis has got four points now in the quarter. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Outside, Brown. From 
Dalton, the arc. Oh, he drains it. His sixth make in nine tries so far. Yeah, he's been having his way this quarter. Attacking the basket and protecting their lead. Pass to Lopez. Portis down low. Working on Williams. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Good man. But the defender really went after him. At the line for the Hawks. At the line for two. He misses the free throw. And he's good on the second. Here's Smart. Ten points for him. Pass to Williams. Back to Smart. Williams with it. That's tipped. Here's Connaughton. He's hoping to avoid a third foul for the break. Now, two points. Giannis Antetokounmpo checked in for Lopez. Substitution. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Williams passes to Smart, and they pick up two. Smart's got four points in the quarter. His teammates keep getting him the ball in his favorite spots. He's done a lot for his shooters. Honor to Kumpo against Williams. Another shot. And the bucket is good yes. from Honor to Kumpo in deep. Honor to Kumpo's got 15 points. I mean, it, it is not easy trying to box out Giannis. His long arms allow him to capitalize on the offensive glass. Now, here's Williams. Outside, Brown. And it's going to be a three-second call. So three-second violation. Jason Tatum. He's checked in for Jalen Brown. For the Celtics, Jason Tatum. Milwaukee has gone just one of four from downtown so far in the second. To the middle. Here's Ana de Kumpo. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Holiday. 17 points in the game. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Smart passes to Williams. Outside White. That shot off. Milwaukee goes the other way with it. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Solid defense from Williams. Boston has gone 5 of 12 from three-point range tonight. White for three. Milwaukee with the rebound. Connaughton's got his fifth rebound in this one. The offensive rebound. Pass to Portis. Now Allen. Now Holiday, defended by Smart. Shot clock at six. Second chance effort. Here's Portis. No luck. They battled on the glass, but they couldn't knock it down. The Celtics shooting 47% on this one. Looking efficient. Smart against Allen. Oh, they get a hand on it. And Giannis Antetokounmpo picks up that foul. That's his first foul. The Celtics making a switch here. Pritchard's checked in. And Milwaukee also making a switch. Ibaka's checked in. Outside Tatum. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's the teardrop. Ooh, great D that time from Ibaka. The Bucks trail. Allen on the wing. Defended by Smart. Anna Kumpo outside. 
Here's Connaughton. Misses the three. This has not been his best quarter. Oh, just off his game, forcing a few shots, not letting the game come to him naturally. His fourth foul already. And we're not even at halftime. He'll likely limit his minutes the rest of the way. White, he's checked in for Boston. Derek White. Remaining in the first half. Two minutes. 156 left in the first half. To stop the drought. He gets it in there. Robert Williams has got his second bucket on the night. That's a perfect setup. Solid screen. Defender can't avoid it. Opens up a clear path to the bucket. Back to Allen. On to Kupo with it. And here's Holiday. Tatum with a steal. 127 left in the second. Nails it from beyond the arc. And it's a 12-point Boston lead. This three-point shot looks so pure. The defense allowing him to get comfortable out there. Milwaukee calls timeout. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. Yeah, they might be pressing a little. I mean, forcing some things. This is a good opportunity to calm everyone down. Now here's Holiday. On to Kumpo. Outside. Pass to Ibaka. Back to Ana Kumpo. For three, Allen. Second chance shot. And the basket by Ana de Kumpo. Ana de Kumpo's got 19. He's been fantastic, but he can't do it all by himself. Some of the other guys need to lighten the load and step up. Outside Tatum. Giannis with the rebound. Adenakumpo has got six rebounds now in the game. They haven't needed him as much as I thought they would. Tonight. And he gets the bucket. Oh, nice feed. On time and on target. Boston's gone 6 of 14 from the perimeter tonight. White, the pass to Tatum. No stopping him there! Jams it in, and he's fouled! An opportunity in a three-point play. It's on Drew Holiday. That's his third personal foul. Fourth team foul. At the line, Jason Tatum. At the line, shooting one. Falls for Tatum. Zero wasted trips. They're doing their job at the line. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Back to Ana Kumpo. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. That one on Tatum. So many times, Giannis forces his man into a foul. Long As a defender, balls. you can't Giannis give him anything easy. That leads to a lot of shots. contact. And that one falls for Ana de Kumpo. And he makes both free throws. Getting themselves to the line this quarter is a good way to get their offense rolling. Tatum against Holiday. 
Pass to Pritchard. Misses the layup. It'll count. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. And so it's Boston. They have a nice nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. More 2K action in just a moment. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Taking a look at the Celtics, they've put themselves in decent shape to grab that all-important Game 1 victory. So far, they've clearly been the better team controlling the flow. By no means is it a runaway, but they've put themselves in a great position. And let's get your thoughts, big fella, on the Celtics. They built this lead from the perimeter. We know they have shooters to do it. We know sometimes they play outside in. This is one of those games that's going on by the script. Impressive performance thus far. And over to Kenny, your thoughts on the Bucks? They're getting mad and falling behind, letting the crowd get into it. That affects your confidence. We'll see if they settle down in the second half. to get back into it here in game one. It's been a clinic out there by Giannis Antetokounmpo. They've leaned on him to provide a lot of offense, and that's how he likes it. This game has his fingerprints all over it. Now looking to replicate what he did in the first half. The Celtics with the lead. On the floor for Milwaukee. Giannis plays the four with Lopez in the middle. Drew Holiday out there with Wesley Matthews. And it's Portis in at the three slot. Sinks it from distance. We love the different ways that Tatum can score. Posting up, facing up, while putting the ball on the floor. He's having a great night. Outside Holiday. Back to Ana de Kumpo. And the shot is good on the assist by Holiday. Holiday's got three assists now in this one. Holiday. Using his size to his advantage. Giannis is a handful to deal with close to the rim. Now here's Smart. Outside Tatum. Got a piece of it. Lopez with the steal. Here's Portis. It's stolen by Smart. Outside, Brown. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Pass to Horford. Five to shoot. Back to Brown. The three is up. The rebound by the Bucks. On to the Kumpo has got rebound number seven tonight. Holiday against Williams. Now Porter's. Lopez. He's got six. And the layup is good off the glass. Lopez has got eight. Outstanding focus from the big man. Lopez is accepting the punishment for muscle. Smart against Portis. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good and he'll go to the line. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. Yeah, it's the attack mindset. No Tim Prevail right there. Sometimes you just got to go with your guts. Marcus Smart. At the line with one shot. Falls for Smart. Into the third. Two minutes in now. Pass to Matthews. 
to the inside. On to the Kumpo. Oh, and Giannis hammers it in. It is just a superstar doing superstar things. Antetokounmpo is lighting it up and showing the variety to his game. Now here's Tatum. He's got 16. Hook loose. Portis with it. Picked up by Tatum. And the Bucks pushing it up now. Now here's Antetokounmpo. Tatum with a steal. And finished off by Tatum. Though he may not explode off the floor, Tatum's lift makes plays like this look easy. Pass to Matthews. And here's Portis. Here's Lopez. Holiday with the ball. Just five to shoot. The Bucs need to get up a shot here. No good on the three. Wow, that's their first shot of the half that hasn't found a mark. It's been a good start. Here's Smart. Out to Horford. Jacks up a three. There's Tatum with the three. Good, and it's Horford who picks up the assist. Tatum's got 21 points in the game. In today's game, you can never afford to get beat in the three-point battle. Holiday passes to Anadokounmpo. And stolen by Williams. Smart against Holiday. And stolen by Anadokounmpo. Jumps up. And Giannis throws it down. Yeah, the length of Giannis is tough to deal with. He uses it to perfection to come up with steals. Smart finds Williams. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Williams has got six points. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. Yeah, yeah. Horrible effort. It appears they may be on the brink of giving up. Now here's Holiday. Inside. Oh, Giannis dunks it home. And Holiday takes this responsibility seriously. When someone is open on his squad, he gets it to him. And the Celtics call time here. And something fans don't always get to see. Some of the closely guarded secrets that happen in that huddle. Yeah, and sometimes it's the most subtle moves that make the biggest difference. It's smart on the wing. Defended by Portis. Down low. Here's Williams. And Williams punches it home. You know, some scouts thought Tatum had tunnel vision looking for only for his own shot. But he's more about team. Pass to Portis. On the wing, Holiday. Over smart. And off the left side of the rim, it swirls in for him. Holiday's got his third bucket of the night. Boston has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. Portis against Smart. And here's Tatum for three. It's hauled in by Portis. Portis has got four rebounds now. Honor to Kumpo is doubled to the paint. Pass to Matthews. Fires the three. Connects from downtown. Matthews. Matthews gotten himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Now here's Smart. He's got 15. There's Tatum with the three. The rebound by the Bucks. On to the Kumpo has got rebound number eight here already in the game. And Drew Holiday gets the whistle that time. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. And that was another look at the aggressive D that led to the mobile one block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Smart with the ball. It's hauled in by Portis. Milwaukee has gone one for two from outside the arc in this third quarter. To the middle. Here's Lopez. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got five rebounds in the game. Celtics foul. Jalen Brown. That's 
to his first personal foul. For Milwaukee, they've gotten seven of their nine shots to fall. Quality shooting in the second half. Pass to Matthews. And here is Hanada Kumpo, hounded by Tatum. Holiday against Smart. Portis. And the shot is good on the assist by Holiday. Holiday's got five assists in the game. Simple. The closer you are to the hoop, the better your chance to score. Now here's Smart. He's got 15. Here's Brown. Sinks it again. That's his seventh main field goal in 11 tries. Now with great physical and athletic tools, Brown's adept at pushing past contact. Smart against Holiday. Pass to Matthews from behind the arc. Knocks it down from Wesley a distance. Matthews. Matthews got six. The three-point shooting has been on point here in the second half. Outside, Brown. The ball's knocked loose. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Lopez. Williams has checked in for Horford. Allen, he's checked in for the Bucks. against Holiday. Four on the clock. And it's Tatum missing. Here's Milwaukee. They're on a 14-6 run. And Allen gets it to go. Backing up that last three with another three. The defense has to stop giving them so many clean looks. Smart passes to Tatum. With the 10-footer. That went off the back iron and out. His interior scoring is one of the things that drives their offense. Don't expect him to miss many though. The Celtics with the lead. From 13. Yep, that one goes. Tatum's got 23. We see time and time again Tatum making a difficult shot against tight. Here's Hanna de Kumpo. Ooh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Robert Williams picks up one. Let's look at the energy stats. How the hustle game has been going for Boston. Their transition game has been clicking today. You can see why they push the ball every chance they get. Their second chance points have been a story all night as well. That's just pure hustle. one falls for him and the Bucks making a change here Carter's checked in second so he hits one of two the Celtics have gone 8 of 15 in the third quarter here's Smart 15 points in the game outside Brown back to Smart the 17 footer good he hits the jumper Smart has got five points now this quarter. Oh, the mid-range game. A lost art. Nice bucket by Smart. Pass to Portis. Now Allen. Lopez with it. There's the triple. 
Williams grabs the board. Now Smart. Takes the three. And they recover it. Milwaukee with the rebound. Kumpo outside and stolen by Williams. Portis against Tatum. From 12 feet. And he can't get that one. Milwaukee has gone 3 of 5 from downtown here in the second half. And that's two awful trips in a row resulting in turnovers. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. The Celtics making a switch here. White's checked in. And here's Smart. He's got 17. White on the wing. With the drive. Blanketed by the D. He fights to the rim for the layup. White's got his first bucket in this one. Great timing and coordination. Lays it in, coming off that pick. Pass to Allen. Over White. And Allen gets it to go. Allen's got five points in the quarter. Austin's gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Williams with it. Rebound, Milwaukee. Lopez has got six rebounds now in the game. A minute 39 left in the third quarter. To the inside. Counted and one. He'll have a chance in the three-point play. He'll pin that one on Marcus Smart. Tice is checked in for Boston. Ibaka, he's checked in for the Bucks. Connaughton comes in for Portis. throw drops for Lopez. An effective low post score with a feathery touch. Lopez continues to prove his worth in this league. Smart against Carter. Pass to Williams. Drives to the hoop. The kick out to White. Fires top of the key. Rebounded by Lopez. Lopez has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the board. Now here's Carter. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game, game from him. Three points. Here's Smart. 59 seconds left in the third. Outside, Brown. Tice outside. All alone. No luck on that one. Milwaukee goes the other way with it. Right now, firing on all cylinders. Yeah, there's a nice flow to this offense right now. Celtics foul. Marcus Smart. That's his second personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for the Bucks. Javon Carter. At the line for two. drops so now they lead by one and so Carter nails them both 
Boston's gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. So it's Milwaukee now. Three second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Here he goes. Allen on the wing. Off target with the three. To halt the run. And there's White. That's good on the assist by Brown. White's got his second basket. Transition basketball. The most reliable way to generate easy looks. Yeah. You can tell they love to get out and run when the opportunity is there. And so it's Jason Tatum making highlights for the Boston Celtics. Continued to rack up points in that quarter. His total for the night to 23. Back to the game after this break. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. And he definitely deserves the award. Reading the defense like a point guard. Oh, beautiful feet. Always a luxury to have a big man who can see the whole foot. And welcome back, folks, for more Eastern Conference semifinal action. We've got Al Horford, Derek White out there with Peyton Pritchard. Then it's Daniel Tice, and it's Tatum in at the small forward position. That's the Boston Five. Pass to Matthews. Here's the three. Doesn't go for him. Tatum with some nice D. It's White with a drive. And he jams it home with authority. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. The Bucks trail. Anadokounmpo outside. Oh, and the dunk by Anadokounmpo. Beyond belief. I mean, such a creative talent. And I'm not surprised to see Giannis get flashy on the finish. Pass to Tatum. And he drives in. Oh! He's trying to tear the hinges off the roof. Oh, that's amazing, the creativity. And you see how fluid and absolute Tatum is. Just over a minute into this final quarter of play. Holiday passes to Lopez. Pass to Matthews. The three. And a great assist by Anadokounmpo. And that one goes in. Anadokounmpo's got three assists tonight. Now White. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. He takes it in. Rejected by Antetokounmpo. A defensive player of the year winner. Antetokounmpo affects so many shots with his length. For Boston, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Pass to Pritchard. Back to Horford. Here's Pritchard. Now here's White. Horford outside. Now here's Tatum. Six on the shot clock. Offline with a three. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Outside Holiday. White with the steal. Takes it inside. Banked it in off the glass. Well, that's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Milwaukee has gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. Pass to Lopez. Here's Matthews. Here's Connaughton. Hits a three-pointer. And the Bucks lead by two. Oh, this one has turned into an absolute nail-biter. Yeah, at this point, you almost expect it to come down to the last possession. White with it, and Lopez picks him up. Now here's White. Tight defense on him. Misses again. Just four for ten from the floor. Milwaukee has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Here's Holiday. It's hauled in by White. The Celtics have got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. And 
again. He drops in the layup off the glass. White's got 10 points here in the second half. Can't ask for a better look with the game in the balance. Pass to Connaughton. Outside Holiday to the wing on the left. And oh, Drew Holiday oh, gets the whistle that time. Drew That'll Holiday. be foul number five on that him. I can't say this enough. Personal you foul. have to value each possession. He looks like he's trying to force things. He's better when he plays within himself. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Tice outside. Pass to Tatum. Shot on the wing. And the sweet roll that time on the rim. That one falls. Tatum's got 27. And here in the fourth, he's been zeroed in, hitting some big-time buckets. Here's Matthews. Tatum with some nice D. And he makes it. Now it's a four-point Boston lead. Wow. They're really being taken advantage of defensively out there. No rim protection whatsoever. Outside Holiday. And the foul on Brook Lopez. That's his third foul so far. Williams has checked in for Horford. Now into the lineup for the Celtics. Brent Williams. The Celtics have gone six for nine here in the fourth quarter. Boy, the offense has been on point. <laughs> they have great timing and great communication. So hard to get stops against them. Here's Williams. And Williams punches it home. A savage reverse jam. That takes great body control. No question. He was making a statement right there, man. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. One of the stories here, Jason Tatum. Man, is he getting it done today? Oh, yeah, no question what they'll be talking about in this timeout. They need to figure out some way to slow him down. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. I was able to listen in on what Mike Budenholzer was going over with his team. He instructed his guys to buckle down, saying, quote, it's do or die time. Let's stay focused and finish like it's a playoff game. We'll see if they can pull it off. Back to you. Thank you for that, Ali. And it's a Celtics ball. They've gone on an 8-0 run. Williams passes to Tatum. It's stolen by Holiday. And the bucket Austin counts. Powell. And he is on his Peyton way to the line. Richard. He'll try to make it a three-point play. Personal foul. At the line for the Bucks. Drew Holiday. One shot. The Celtics have gotten seven of their first ten shots to go during this fourth quarter. Pass to Tatum. And finished by Tatum! Wow! Wow! That type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch! That's certainly a big-time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. Here's White. Tice left side. Outside Tatum. The 11-footer. The rebound by the Bucks. Holiday with the ball. Rebound Boston. Tatum's got four rebounds now. Launches it. Oh, wow. He drew the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. Tatum has a good feel for catching defenders off balance. I mean, what's he going to do at the line? Jason Tatum at the line for three shots. And 
he makes a first. Jalen Brown, he's checked in for Boston. Smart comes in for Pritchard. And he sinks the second. And he nails the third. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. For Milwaukee, they've gotten four of nine shots to go in during this fourth quarter. Here's Anadokounmpo. Outside Holiday. And a great assist by Anadokounmpo. And that one goes in. He's getting hotter the deeper we get into this game. I mean, he didn't give him, he didn't give him much of anything in the first half. Here's Smart. To Brown. Just five on the clock. And the jam by Brown. Well, the near seven foot wingspan of Jalen Brown is hot. Now, this is a guy who can go Brown with the block. And that's out of bounds. Milwaukee will keep it. And the Bucks with some changes. Portis comes in for Lopez. And it's Allen in for Matthews. Allen, pass to Anadokounmpo. Here's Connaughton. He buries it from three. Connaughton's got six points in the quarter. Just a selfless play by Giannis. He knows all eyes are on him, so he dishes to a ready shooter. And the Celtics call time here. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. Yeah, I, I like the chess matches going on. Each team trying to find and exploit the favorable matchup on the floor. Let's take a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Jason Tatum. He has truly put on a show out there tonight. Tearing it up on both ends of the floor. So impressive. And the other squad has looked helpless to stop him. Tice outside. Up top Tatum. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Tatum's got 36 points. Well, with the roll he's on this quarter, they're, they're going to keep going to him. And get that lead even bigger. Here's Holiday. And Holiday powers it home. Boy, I'll tell you, when Holiday shifts gears, he quickly leaves people behind. Smart, up top. Williams passes to Tatum. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. Uh, yeah, the footwork, the positioning. Tatum's a difficult cover inside. the line Jason Tatum at the line for two shots down the first one. The Celtics making a switch here. Williams is checked in. And that's good as he hits both shots. Oh, you can get spoiled watching him at the line. I mean, you just expect him to make every one every time. Here's Allen. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Hey, if you can't block it, sending him to the line can be the next best thing. Shooting for Milwaukee. Grayson Allen taking two shots.
free throw good from Allen. And so he hits both. The Celtics with the lead. Smart passes to Williams. Holiday against Tatum. And here is Williams. And here's Brown for three. Knocks down the triple. Brown's got 21. And launched his first three of the second half. After the other two of the first, they don't want to let this from him go. Here's Anadokounmpo. And Anadokounmpo nice. with the jam. The incomparable length. I mean, Giannis with those big strides and the reach to finish against anyone. Boston's gone one for two from deep in this fourth quarter. Here's Smart. An easy two on the layup. 19 points in the game. For Milwaukee, they've gotten 8 of 14 shots to drop so far here in the fourth quarter. Holiday against Williams. Pass to Holiday. It's dipped. Allen with it. Four on the clock. On it to Kumpo. Left side. And they double up on it to Kumpo. For three, Allen. Tatum pulls it in. Allen's got just two of eight to find the net from deep. Holiday against Tatum. Driving inside. Good on the bucket. Tatum's got 40 points. He gets hit on the drive. Excellent body control. Tatum's a well-coordinated athlete. Inside. Here's Portis. And then Portis with the dunk. With the explosive leaping ability, he's able to play center despite being undersized. Boston. And the Celtics call time here. And so the ball out of bounds. Ana de Kupo touched it last. He clipped the ball there, but not enough to nab the steal. Uh, appreciate the effort, though, making his presence felt defensively. Milwaukee on D. Trailing by eight. Pass to Brown. The kick out to Williams. Let's it go from deep. Rebounded by the Bucks. Anacupo has got 11 rebounds in the game. Holiday drives in, and Holiday powers it home. Did you see that? That was one of the best moves I've ever seen. Picture perfect execution. He was focused and refused to be denied. Tatum against Holiday. A nice shot by Tatum. Tatum's got 42 in the game. Excellent control from Tatum. The assertiveness he displays on these possessions is why people love this guy. Here's Ana de Kumpo. And Giannis with the dunk. Now that's how you use the screen right there. And it leads to a thunderous finish. That was nice. Yeah, coach is definitely pleased. That's the execution we love to see. D from Allen. The Bucks trail. On Kumpo outside. Gets to the rim for yes. two with the D all over him. On Kumpo has got 17 points here in the second half. Here's Brown. Oh, and a dunk by Brown. You can't tease that. Brown just showing off his incredible dunking ability. Things aren't looking good here. I mean, they need points, and they need a map. Yeah. Uh, quite unlikely. Yeah, We've seen crazy things happen. You expect 
this from an MVP like Giannis. He never gives up on the game. Woo! Gotta love it. Here's Brown. Kicks it out to Smart. Outside, Williams. Five on the clock. Fires in the triple. And the Celtics lead by seven. And they just continue to attack, even late in the games, while they're up big. And it's not about running up the score. It's about closing the door on any kind of comeback. Right now called, Milwaukee. They're trailing by seven. 44 seconds left in the fourth. For three, Allen. The shot off that time. Now the Celtics take it the other way. They've led by as many as 14. Smart passes to Williams. Kicks it out to Smart. This one for three. The rebound by Allen. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Anadokounmpo. Three-pointer. Money. And now they trail by just four. During this final quarter, he's erupted from outside the arc. Just assume every three he takes now is going in. And the Celtics call time here. They're on top by four. 19 seconds left in the final quarter. 19 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. And they foul intentionally. Now they're going to have to do that again. They're not in the penalty just yet. Yeah, just a must-foul situation to stop the clock. Tatum passes to Smart, and Drew Holiday gets the whistle that time. And so he's picked up his final foul, and he'll sit the rest of this one out. He can't be happy with fouling out, but the game seems out of reach anyways. Yeah, too bad he fouled out. But this team does have some depth at his position. And no good as the first free throw misses. We'll see if he can hit the second. And he ends up making the second. And that puts him up five. Pass to Matthews. Brown with the steal. Driving to the basket. And he banks in the layup. Considering Brown's size. That's why he's always been such an intriguing prospect. So we see the Celtics get the win here. And it always takes a lot of pressure off a team when they get the win in game one. It's the most important game of the series. They've shown they know how to beat this team. The formula's in place. Now they just have to stick with it for the next few games. And now we have Allie LaForce standing with the player of the game. Allie, take it away. Thanks, Jason. This team is on a roll. Plenty of energy on the sidelines. How much fun are you having out there? Uh, winning is fun. Uh, you know, hopefully we can keep it up, especially at home. Uh, you know, we don't want to let our fans down. We got the best fans in the league. And they give us all the energy in the world. So uh, you know, we appreciate it. Doing it for the fans. Thanks, Jason.